Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to lead you through a 15 minute leg workout with no equipment. So you can do this workout absolutely anywhere. Just make sure you have a little bit of space around you and we are gonna be on the floor. So just make sure you have something soft beneath you. Other than that, just make sure that you can see your screen so you can follow along with me. And without further ado, let's get to it. All right guys, first up, we are going to start off with a narrow squat coming all the way down and then you're coming up into a curtsy lunge to the side, back through center, other side. So really make sure you're sitting into your heels and coming all the way down. You don't have to go as fast as me, just make sure that your form is correct. Good, taking a quick 15 second rest. Next up, we're gonna do some reverse lunges. So choose a side, we're gonna do 30 seconds on each leg. You're doing two pulses, down, down, pressing through the supporting heel, coming up, driving that knee up, keeping that core nice and tight. Here we go. Two, and up. So again, make sure you're sitting into this heel, you're sitting back in that lunge using that glute to push yourself up. All right, we're gonna switch sides. Last one. Good, quick 15 second rest. Next up, we are doing a sumo squat at the bottom of your squat. Rise up on those tippy toes, down, coming all the way up, squeezing those inner thighs together, rising all the way up. Here we go. Make sure you squeeze those glutes at the top, really squeeze those thighs together. Nice work. We are heading to the ground. We are going to do a fire hydrant, 30 seconds on each leg. You're doing one, two. On the second one, you're holding, extending that leg, bringing it in and lower. Here we go. One, two and hold, extend in and down. Hold that core nice and tight. Just focus on that working leg. Getting ready to switch legs. When you extend that leg, Hold that knee nice and high. Nice. 
All right, next up, taking a quick 15 second rest. We're gonna do some kickbacks. We're gonna do two kickbacks. So extending one leg, one, two, bring it in and out, nice and simple. Down, up, down, up, in and out. When you extend that leg back out, keep those toes nice and high. Also keep that core tight. You're not using your back here, just that working leg. Getting ready to switch legs. Good, we're gonna stand up next. We're gonna do some side lunges. So, we're gonna do 30 seconds on each leg. You're coming down, make sure that knee is stacked right over top of those toes. Push off of this leg, back over to center. Down and up. So really press through that heel, sit back into that lunge. and squeeze those inner thighs together as you come up. Squeeze. Getting ready to switch legs. Good, 15 second rest. We're gonna finish off this first round with 30 seconds of a sumo squat pulse. So coming down, your toes are pointed outward, sitting down, and we're just gonna hold for 30 seconds. Here we go. Pulse it out, stay nice and low. So this is the end of our first round. We're going to repeat the first three exercises and then the last bit will change up the stuff that we did on the ground. Eight more seconds. All right, we're going right into those narrow squats to curtsy lunges. Here we go. Down and to the side. Nice work, 15 second rest, get those legs a little bit of a shake. We're gonna go into our reverse lunges, two pulses, driving that knee upward, squeezing that supporting leg, here we go. Good, getting ready to switch legs. Hello. Hello. Even if we're hanging by a thread, by a 
Sit back into that lunge, press through that heel. Nice and strong as you drive that knee up. Last one. Nice work. All right, going back to that sumo squat with a rise at the bottom, squeezing as we come up and squeezing those inner thighs at the top. I really want you to focus on bringing those heels up as high as possible and making sure those legs are nice and straight. Here we go, down, all the way up on the toes. Squeeze, stretch those legs, and lower. Last one. Nice work. Heading to the ground. Now we're gonna focus on our inner and outer thighs. So legs are bent. We're gonna do 30 seconds on each leg. Starting off with one leg, you're really gonna focus on pressing that lower back into the floor, keeping your core tight as you drop that leg out. Use that inner thigh to bring the leg up. Nice and simple. So really focus on just using that leg and keeping the upper body nice and still. Getting ready to switch legs. Really let that leg drop and use that rebound to use that inner thigh to squeeze it up. Last one. Nice. All right, staying on the ground, working on our outer thighs now. You're gonna come up. You can do this either laying down or propped up. I'm gonna do it propped up on my hand, but top of your foot faces forward, lifting that leg up, squeezing that outer thigh and that glute. Getting ready to switch sides. Make sure you've got that tailbone tucked under belly button to spine and you're just using that working leg. Good, we're coming to the ground on our backs. 15 second rest. We are nice and simple, just doing one leg glute bridges. So 30 seconds on each leg, one leg is up. Remembering to tuck that tailbone under or tilt the pelvis forward and press that lower back into the floor every time you lower your hips and press those hips up nice and high. Getting ready to switch legs. Yeah. 
magic. <sighs> Good, standing up. <sighs> Last 30 seconds, we're doing our sumo pulse. We're gonna pulse it out, feel the burn, and then we're done. <sighs> Here we go, nice and low. Try to push your weight into your heels and kind of flex those booty muscles. 12 more seconds. And that is it. Great job, guys. Give your legs a little bit of a shake. Well done. All right guys, I hope you enjoyed this quick 15 minute leg workout with no equipment. I love this one because you can do it absolutely anywhere. It's a no excuses workout. It's only 15 minutes. Let me know how you guys enjoyed this one in the comments down below. If you're new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on your post notifications so you don't miss another video from me. And I'll see you guys very soon. Bye.